Hello everybody, welcome back for another episode of Ultra Challenge! Last time we beat the Earth Elemental Earth stages. This time we're doing the Elemental Water stages. I looked it up and yes, I do have to do the Water stages. So I was correct. Thank you. The Tundra Beast. It absorbs warmth and light from the inhabitants of the Earth. What makes it evil? It's an animal! Chalk in his... Kinda of rude. What the f Are you fucking That is some that is some bullshit. So um water level What? You can't jump too high or you get a stalagmite in the head? Are you Fuck this level and it's asshole Fuck this level and it's dirty asshole What the hell are you supposed to do? What? What the difference between those spikes and the other spikes? Oh, never mind. Those are straight insta kill spikes no matter what you do. This is another maze! It's another maze! Why do levels like this? Give the player no indication of where they're going or what they're doing. Okay, so spike pits are instant kill. That's fair. All the while, you have to fight ice physics the whole time. There's a pulley system? Oh. Well, hell. What? 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 So what, is a bad fate to be fallen upon me, or what? I don't... You know, it's safe to say that I really just have no clue where I'm going. Great, looks like you're gonna need the high jump spell. I mean, let me be honest with you guys. Polka honest. I... This is beautiful collision detection right here. I'm gonna check if I'm going the right way. I was supposed to go down from there and then go to the right with the pulleys. Of course, of course I'd be going the wrong direction. Of course I would. But why the fuck else would they design this level so horribly? Mmm, fuck! 
Fuck ice physics. It's already luck enough for me to get onto the goddamn pulleys. So then when you finally get your moment where you want to just be like da 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 Nope, you fall off the platform because of ice physics. Isn't that fair? And if you fall into any of these holes, it's instant kill. You fall into instant kill water. So I was much closer to the exit than I realized. Like, literally, I was in, like, feet of it. So maybe if these- if the next few water levels go by smoothly, this might just be the finale. I might end up just making this the finale, because I really don't want to play this anymore. I fucking hate this game. I can't jump down? What the fuck? Actually, this level seems... I was about to say this level seems linear, but... Either I'm doing- going about this wrong, or... Where the fuck? Mallet? Do I mallet these out of the way? How do you do? Maybe it requires a spell. Let's see. Okay, so I did need the mallet. I was just whacking in the wrong place. Please don't tell me this is the this is the main mechanic of this fucking level and it's broken. Oh. Where the fuck do I go? You literally just had to jam on the controller in vain that it works! And this level's a maze! Actually, this level might not be a maze. I need to go to a weapon and let me double jump. Holy fuck! You just have to hope in vain that a certain attack with the mallet comes out. How the fuck are you supposed to get a handle of that? Please just let me out of here. Okay, here we go. We have to do it again. So, like... Are you fucking kidding me? Another leap of faith. What is with this game and leaps of fucking faith? Oh. You actually have to do the motion of swinging up and down with the mallet. 
Why? 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 I'm not gonna get over that. What is this fucking game? What is it? Ga what is this game? What am I playing? What am I even playing right now? This is the dumbest game in the history of the fucking planet! <laughs> what the fuck? Excuse me, the ice went through the fucking concrete. Went through the fucking cinder block. Didn't even give a shit. Okay, alright, whatever. Nobody gives a fuck. I got pushed off the platform because this game chokes a dick. What? Oh, come on! Magus! The first time I've name dropped him in the series. Well, actually, I probably have multiple times, but not in grief. Not in grief. Just. Uh... Please hope to God the end is just right here. No, wait, I have to whack the floor again. Why? What? I mean, I am getting used to it. It's not like. But it's like. It's such a fucking backwards mechanic. And you're just like, why? What's the point? Why am I doing this? Wanna well, whack this out of the way too? Holy fuck! Go away! I feel like I went the wrong way again. I- no, I actually- This guy is difficulty doing it. Okay, so I definitely went the right way. Yeah, I actually went through the right way the first time! What the fuck? Okay, so he gets to the same place I do. And then where the fuck? It's a- is it really a fake fucking wall? <sighs> I feel like a complete and utter jack wagon. I mean, honestly, I really do feel like a complete jack wagon right now. Like, how the fuck are you supposed to know this shit? I'm just gonna assume that I'm going the right way. God damn, these fucking platforms suck. It's not like other games where it's like the platforms just blend together. Like, no, they push you around and shit. Like, even in the fire level, this isn't exclusive to the ice. No! I mean, with the ice, it does get pretty annoying, but... Okay. Thank you. Okay! We're getting through this level slowly and comfortably, so this is not the finale, because this is taking a fortnight. Are you fucking kidding me? Yep. Yeah, this is taking a fucking fortnight to beat. Oh, fuck. 
How do I kill this guy? I, yeah, I just had to use the swords to deal with him. Because it seemed like he was pre presenting no obvious way to beat him with the mallet. Wow, I hella sounded like H2O Delirious right there. <laughs> Honestly, I don't I don't really actively watch H2O Delirious, but I love him. He's funny. Just because he makes silly, goofy sounds like I do. Fuck, I knew it was gonna happen! I knew! So I didn't go the wrong way. I actually went the right way! How'd I go the right way for something? I know. Okay. Are you fu There's a ledge right fucking there. Yes. Thank fuck. Oh. Uh. Okay. It's fine. We only have one more fucking level of this to go. Oh my god, I hate this game. I hate this game. I'm trying to put it behind me. I'm trying to put this... You fucking son of a bitch. I can do that. Just... Why? Why? Why do I have to do it? <sighs> okay. No! No! Fuck you! Okay, never mind. Use the mallet! Of course, use the mallet. Everything this level's taught me so far is that the mallet is your fucking best friend! Fuck! I hate how you can't double jump with certain weapons. It's like, hey, you know how to double jump? Good for you. You wanna use the mountain double jump? Fuck your shit. Okay, I killed him. Now the thing is, it's gonna layer me onto the fucking thing. Now the thing is, I have to try to get there with as much life as humanly possible because of the fucking... Because <sighs> there's a boss at the end of this, and guess what? It seems like every boss I make it to, I either have too little life or they have such a fucking bullshit pattern that I can't do anything. Okay, just fuck this thing! It's a troll! Fuck you then! Sack of shit! Bless me. No! No! <laughs> I I just need my whole setup. Okay. <sighs> So I feel like I'm going the right way. Yeah, your only option is to go up. So you better be ready to fucking fight enemies the moment you touch these platforms, you fuck! That's what the game is saying to me right now. You better be ready to fight these enemies, you fuck! Okay, here we go. Instant kill jump. Guess who does not give a singular shit? This guy, right here. Right here. 
Also known as Reaper Vegas. That's that's the name I've chosen for myself. Because I feel it sounds cool and I like Grim Reaper. I like I like Reapers. No! No! Alright, so pretty much all of the hard hitting weapons. Fuck. Kill these fuckers in one hit. Like, wasn't it too much trouble to ask for just 12 levels and then have and then just a final boss fight and then have it end? Eh, of course not! No! They added this whole additional campaign afterwards! That's required to beat the fucking thing! Oh my god. Whack the ice! Fuck. What if this ball is fake? No, it's not fake! Why would it be fake? Okay, so you are supposed to go to the right. Either that or it is a death trap. I feel like this is a death trap. Wait, he's still doing level 2. What the fuck? Okay, so he gets to where I am anyway. So that's basically the least efficient path. Huh? I just watched the video. You could just whack the ice before. And why does it work? Oh. Thanks, bro. You know how much of a dependence I've needed on the walkthrough? Too much. It's fine, we can now fight the stupid Tundra Beast. Except I have no clue how you fight it. How do you damage this thing? Mallet. Okay, with the mallet, it should probably die in a few hits. supposed to jump over it over and over and over. It'll come up and try to swat at you. Okay. Let's take his word for it and fight the Tundra Beast. lasers out of his eyes! I didn't know he was supposed to get out of his way. My god, that takes off two fucking hits.
How the fuck are you even supposed to know he's gonna rise up? Okay, so when he does the attack, you can you can hurt him. God damn it. Seems like most things in this game now are doing one full skull of damage. Alright, I feel like he's gonna rise. No, he didn't. This boss is fucking irritating, just like all the other ones. So really, who gives a fuck? Alright, so he did the lasers. Alright, he's gonna do the claw raise attack. And he's gonna come up. And then just whack him in the face. This is boring as shit. <laughs> this is boring as fuck. This is boring as hell. Oh, oh god damn it. Right in his goofy ass face. Right in his goofy ass fucking face. God damn it. Okay. This is so dull. This is so boring! Fuck! Fork. Mount Fork more. If I had subtitles, that would definitely be the name of this episode. Mount Fork More. Cause why the hell not? Why not? Right? What am I doing not crouching against that? Okay. And then, whack him in the face! Alright, whack him in the face, then crouch. Okay. This is taking forever! God damn! And then you have to jump at specific times. You can't just jump whenever you want. All right, crouch, save. He'll come up, jump, and then save. And then smash him in the face, crouch, save. Fudge. So that's one cross, two cross, three cross, Four cross. Fuck. He might cross on the fourth. Yep, it's on the. F okay. He attacks after the fourth cross. Criss cross! Criss cross! Freeze! Everybody clap your hands! I'm not gonna do it. Fuck you. I said it. See, you probably did it at home, but I didn't, because I'm not stupid. So that's one, two, let's see if we can get this all done in one shot, in one shot. Three, four, and then move a few inches, and then duck, shoot the laser, go over, he goes out, jump, and then wait, and then smack. Or, you know, just completely fuck it up and have to do the entire cycle again because Chalkin loves NOT TURNING THE FUCK AROUND?! Like, seriously, that's one of the most irritating aspects of this game. Sometimes, the controls can be the absolute worst. They really can be the worst because... You could have this whole thing set up. And then fuck it up in the la in the next few seconds. That's a one. That's two. That's three. And that's four. And then palm up. I didn't realize he was completely invulnerable during those attacks. 
fine, I'll take the damage. I mean, he should be close to death, right, anyway. I mean, he has, like, a skull-type thing protecting his head. And then, whack him in the face. Yes! There we go, we got it. Wow, that was the most tedious fucking boss fight ever. That made it crack into 30 minutes. Anyway! All that's left are for the elemental air stages. That's it. This is the end right here. The finale is sitting right in our face. So anyway, next time on the Chack and Ultra Challenge, we're going to beat the game. Finally. I'll see you all next time. Only you can prevent forest fires.